I'm Jimmy Kimmel. I'm down here um, to be on the show today. Um, and I think that's it. Well, what are you here to talk to Howard about? What's going on? What's happening, Gary? <laughs> I'm going through the yeah. traditional interrogation that never gets on. Um, I'm here to talk to Howard. I'm not, I have nothing to talk to Howard about today. I'm, uh, I figure we'll, something will happen when we, we get in there. I hear that they have my biggest fan here. I fear that it's a certain um, high-pitched um, gentleman that's in the hall. Now, why do you say that? <laughs> so, uh, he appears to be in, very much in love with me, and, and uh, what a lucky fellow I am. Jimmy Kimmel stopping by for about an hour this morning. I like Jimmy. Jimmy and I are email friends. We talk on the phone once in a while. I was going to say, who's Jimmy Kimmel? Jimmy Kimmel is the guy. He got a, a, a late-night show on ABC. Let's see what he looks like. Yeah, there's the guy up from TV. Oh. Jimmy Kimmel, good times. <laughs> Jimmy Kimmel, good times. Good to see you. <laughs> Jimmy J.J. Kimmel. Look at him slimming down. What does he think he He's is? He's got to slim down. <laughs> Hollywood a TV. A TV star? He's a Hollywood TV star. <laughs> Started out in radio. Thanks. And now he's a TV star. Good What's you. happening? Hey, People man. always ask me if I've slimmed down, but I actually I'm, I've been at this exact weight for about five years. Is that true? You yeah. Thinner. Well, I'm, yeah, to me, I'm wearing right, stylish that. clothing. Thank yeah. you. Maybe that's you just it. had a colonic. <laughs> <laughs> you, you never wear a tie on your show. You always have the T-shirt sticking out from underneath your shirt. I'm trying to establish a look. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, a lot of people are going through that. A lot of Israelis dress that way. <laughs> well, he's trying to show people he hasn't left them. He's right. still. It's my blue collar. Jimmy. Roots. Yeah. You yeah. should come out with a Jimmy Kimmel line of clothing like Carson did. Yeah. You know what? That's a great idea. Yeah. Like OJ Dingo boots. Yeah. How about <laughs> attaching the little? Um, Top of a T-shirt or an mm -hmm. undershirt to the to the shirt, so you don't actually have to wear one. He doesn't wear an undershirt. That's just a little piece of an undershirt. Ah, right? that he's already done that. would done be that. something. It's a dicky. <laughs> 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 How's it going? Good. How are you? We were reading that survey on the air that says, did yeah. you see that thing? Of course. Of now course. that the Johnny AOL Carson is dead, yeah. AOL took a survey. They said, who will be the late night king? It's a very tasteful survey in the first place. Yes. Second, <laughs> he's dead. They want to know who the late night king is. Now, here's the result. Right. Letterman, 40%. He is now the late night king. Leno, 31%. Conan O'Brien, 11%. John Stewart, 9%. Mm -hmm. Other, 5%. Jimmy Kimmel, 2%. Now, you got beat out by Other. So yeah. if it came down to Other or you, Other is going to win. And by the way, at least 1% was me voting furiously from my home. I, mean, I bet. <laughs> I would do the same thing. It's embarrassing. No, it, it is embarrassing, but I was, in a way, glad to be even on the list. Uh, right. Does but realistically, who the hell is voting for me as a late-night king? Right. No, well, I would vote for you. Thank you. I mean, you're a friend. <laughs> What's going on in your lip? Is that a herpes? Let me I don't see. know. Is Let me see. He's got no, I don't have. I know. You got gloss on. What do you got? Lipstick? He's glossing. Yes, you do. <laughs> do not get the wet look going. Oh, get a wet look. Your lips are it's all wet spit. and succulent. It's called spit. Oh man, what's going I on? I had to kiss high pitched Derek on the way in here. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Hi, Jimmy. That's me. your that's your biggest fan. That's it. <laughs> oh, is that who it is? High pitched calling goes. Can I come in and see Jimmy? Yeah. It was a wonderful greeting. What an insane asylum this is. Yeah. We were supposed to keep you away from uh, yeah. high pitch. Well, he was waiting for me in the lobby. Oh, that's good. Yeah. Another bit well Great worked surprise. out. I know. Yeah. What are you gonna do? Hi. This is High Pitch Eric. I'm here to see, to see Jimmy Kimmel. I want to give him a few uh, ideas that I have for his show on Channel Seven. Now, you like Jimmy Kimmel? I love Jimmy Kimmel. Why? Because, you know, I want to do a talk show like he does. A late night show. But what do you like about Jimmy? That I love his show. I watch his show every time on ABC. What is it about him that you like? His looks? He's funny? What's, what's... He's funny like I am. He's a character. He's a comedian like I am. I want to show him the skills I have. I want to, be, I want to see if I can work for his show as an announcer. Okay, now give me a little, you know, example of some of your skills. Uh, like, if I, if I were to ask him if I could work on the show as an announcer, I would say, It's the Jimmy Kimmel Show! Starring Jimmy Kimmel! I mean, I, I mean, John went to Jay Leno, so I'm going to see if I can go to Jimmy Kimmel. All right, man, we'll see in a few minutes. I got my tattoos also. Oh, yeah, let me see those. Okay, this this are my, these are my two first tattoos, okay? And these, this is my other two tattoos right here. Only God can judge me. Watch! Hey, watch! Hey! 
Hey, l- b- listen, since you're in such a friggin' rush, yeah. let High Pitch come in and see. He wants it. He's been like calling us all week. Can I meet Jimmy? <laughs> yeah, Can he I- calls me at work sometimes, and Who's uh, high pitch? he puts on. He's he's diabolical. He's got such a wide variety of voices that <laughs> it's impossible to detect who it is. He calls Jimmy and phony phone calls him all the time. Oh oh my God. <laughs> so why does he have his shirt off? Because <laughs> he's in love necessary? with you. Why do you have your shirt off? <laughs> to, to say hi, Jimmy. <laughs> why do you have your shirt off? Seriously. <laughs> to say hi, Jimmy. Oh, all right. Oh, Are you in love with Jimmy? Yeah. <laughs> Show Jimmy your new tattoos. You got to see this. Yeah, I heard you talking about these. <laughs> the true player, right? <laughs> Only God can judge me. Only God can judge you. Well, guess what? (laughs) Yeah, I'm sure. I think he has. Get in line. Have you ever seen high pitch when people put fish in his face? Yeah, he's. Oh yeah, he's leaving. Oh my goodness. Oh my God. I think he just hit somebody. Wow. High pitch right out of here. No, he's not letting anybody in. He's in. He's not letting anyone in the studio. Oh, you mean he's holding the door? Yeah. Oh no, I knew this was going to happen. Seeming like a assault on precinct 13. No, no, no. Uh, Go back. Go back. Go back. Go back. Go back. Oh, oh, my God. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> what the hell? Is he going nuts? He hates fish. Yeah. Wow. What? When as soon as you said fish, he ran. He turned around. Right? So I was standing at the door with a fish. How, he got like superhuman strength. I know. Go on camera. He's but 400 he's like, pounds. And he slammed the door. He hates fish. Oh, that's too funny. Nah. That may have been the shortest appearance ever. By the way. Good yeah, times. Now you know how to get rid of him. That was great. Wow. In the green room now, like practically crying. So really, uh, really so calm him down. This is embarrassing. I'll fish, never recover. Fish are his kryptonite. <laughs> they really are. Tell him to come back in. Eric, I swear to you, the fish are away. Come back in. Howard wants to talk to you. I promise. I swear to life, my kids. Let's, guys, fish away. Come on back in. They're away. Come on. Look, Eric. Wait, look, look, look. No fish. No, 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 no we're fish. not. No fish. Eric, look. No fish. Come on. I walk down this no, way. No, it's going to happen again. No, no, no it's not. not. If I wanted it to happen again, I'd go like that. But I don't have one. So come on. Come on. He wants to talk to you. Come on in, Eric. It's not going to happen again. It's not going to happen again. It's going to happen again. It's going to happen again. Hey, come in, come in. It's going to happen again. It's going to happen again. Dude, my heart's being fast. My heart's being fast. <laughs> oh, you know, tell him to calm down. Howard, dude, he, I, I, I said I, I, Feel my, I'm not touching that thing. What a doofus. Get Feel in here, heart. high pitch. Yeah. Get in here, high pitch. Jimmy. Where is he? <laughs> yes. Uh, listen, I have a couple of show ideas for us. <laughs> well, come in here and pitch him. Okay, you ready for No, I can't hear, I can't hear you very in, well. You have to come you. in here. It's going to happen again. I what? can't hear anything. I can't hear him at all. Now he's all hyperventilating. All right, just stay out there and relax. Go ahead, talk now. I want to do a fishing show with High Pitch Eric. <laughs> <laughs> so, Jimmy, I have a couple of show ideas. Yes. All right, go ahead. Okay, so uh, I was thinking about me and you doing our own man show. You'd be the host, I'd be the power bottom. Okay. Okay, now how about me and you? Uh, how about me to being the announcer for the Jimmy Kimmel show when like John went to Jay Leno? You can pay me 100000 a year. <laughs> okay. All right. Okay. What else? Uh, how about you like my boobs? How about you kiss my boobs because I have better boobs than Sarah Silverman? How about I jam a fish down your throat? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> nah. Jimmy. You, you swallow a live fish. Hey, I just have to point out that while yeah. Eric's talking, his breath reeks and his gums are as like bloody and gross as ever. Oh. Hey. Believe me, the fish were running from him. Yeah, I know. The poor fish hey, had to be next. Hey, Eric, I got an idea. You, Jimmy could lop off your head and go bowling with your head. <laughs> Jimmy, you want to go out with me tonight? Okay. All right, Eric, go calm down. Hey, okay? Jimmy, why do you see me at the Hook 18 tonight? I'm doing comedy. You want to hear my impressions? Sure. Okay. Hey, you talking to me? You talking? All right, I had enough of that. <laughs> that bit is over. Right, leave him alone. No more fish for him. He can't handle it. That's the best. If he wants to have a comedy act, they, he should just come on with fish. Eric, hey, why'd you freak out for? Because I did. As soon as Howard said the word fish, I knew something was going to happen. But what is it about fish that you don't like? I just, because when you look, 
when they're dead, and that's it. Jimmy, it was great. So, so how do you think High Peaks Eric's audition went? I um I've never I've never seen a reaction like that ever before to the fish. Eric, that was something else. You steal my heart. Like you steal Howard's ideas. Thank you. Thank you. Well, you are a good man. <laughs> Listen, can I come on your show? No. Please. No. What's your opinion of High Eric? He High Pitch Eric is an interesting person. I mean, yeah, 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 man, all the best. Take care. He hates fish, but he smells like one. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. You know what? I have to say, if I was him, I would be so pissed at God because God f that son of a bitch up in a bad way. <laughs> the voice is just the tip of the iceberg.